Good morning, everybody. Evening or afternoon, actually, wherever you're at, whatever time you're watching this. But I thought I would do a, another update video, except this time we're out taking pictures. So, got done with some stuff in Lynchburg. About to go back in a couple weeks. Um, get out on the parkway some. But while we were up there this last time, I took some great shots of uh, Falling Creek Falls out in the Allegheny National Forest. That was like an hour from it. So, I drove out to it. Got some beautiful autumn color out there. Um, today, this weekend, where we've been gone so much over the last month and a half for music festivals and Jody's Health and work in Lynchburg, I was like, we're staying home this weekend. But I wanted to get out and take some pictures. So today, I'm out in Kingsport, uh, which is five minutes up the road from me. And you can see the sun coming up over my shoulder here. We're going to go up to Bays Mountain today, check out some of the color up there. Hopefully get some good autumn shots along the lake. But this morning, I am on the old Netherland Inn Bridge. And behind me, you can see another bridge, the Holston River. And I'm shooting down that way. I'm hoping that sky's going to catch in a minute. But I just did uh, a couple 40 se 45 second exposure shots uh, with some of the cars going over the bridge and look good. Um, so hopefully those shots come out <laughs> the way I like it when I get back home. But I'm going to show you uh, the shots of Falling Creek Falls here in a second because those shots came out so good. I am so happy with those. I'm so glad I drove the other hour up the way uh, to see that because that was a great time to catch it. It was at its peak for sure. Um, I'm debating on shooting Bay's Mountain behind me because that's we're going to go to the top of that here in a little bit when the park opens at 8 a.m. Right now it's 7.30. Sun's just coming up. Um, but yeah, try to get some good shots today. There's a shot up the road I want to get of Bay's Mountain too before we head up that way. So we got a couple stops before we get up there, but... It's looking good. Beautiful morning. I'm glad to be out and glad to be home for a little bit. <laughs> but yeah, it's been good. Thank you to all the new followers and subscri uh, subscribers that's joined the channel. I greatly appreciate that. Um, yeah, for those that don't know, this is just photography vlogs. You know, I just take you along the little adventures and show you the pictures afterwards. So. We have fun. <laughs> I like to document when I get old, I'll look back on these and go, oh yeah, we went and did that or whatever, you know. But yeah, I'm going to keep shooting this because the light's looking pretty good. The fall color's coming through nice. And then we'll catch back up with you here shortly. Alrighty, guys. Well, I completely forgot that they open at 11 on Sundays. Horse crap. That stinks. All right, now I gotta go find something else to shoot. So, since Bay's Mountain was closed, I decided to take the back road toward home. And I'm trying to think of where I wanna go. I don't know where I wanna go. I really don't. Stinks. Hmm. I was thinking maybe a little run. I've done that so much. I'm just sick of doing it. Um. Hmm, kind of put a damper in my stuff. I don't know. I really just don't know. I'm going to look to roam around and see what I can find. It's pretty out here on the back roads right now. Uh, the only problem is the back roads have nowhere to pull off. And I'm, I think I'm going to go towards Sigourneville because there are a couple boat ramps and the fog is out along the river so I might get something cool out that way so I think that might be what I do go out that way and see what I find up there but in the meantime while I'm trying to find where I want to go here are the pictures I took this morning along with we'll start out with the photos of uh, Falling Creek Falls in the Allegheny National Forest I took last weekend when we were up in Lynchburg, because I mentioned that earlier, I want to show them off. So check them out, and then it'll go into the photos 
from this morning uh, starting out at the bridge. So, yeah, I'm going to go try to find something to shoot. So I found a nice spot along the river here, um, getting a little bit of light down here on the edge with some fog, and I've got my 100 to 400 lens on, and I'm trying to get some good foggy detail shots. It's really nice right now, so I'm actually loving this a lot. This was a good find. I'm glad I came out this way. I see a few things I want to shoot as well. Um, so we'll have to see. Uh, I'm going to try to work as quick as I can because, you know, the sun's coming up higher, more stuff's getting light on, and it's changing pretty quick. So I'm going to stop talking to you all, focus on this, and see if we can come away with some really good stuff. But, oh man, this, this is nice. The, the river's almost like glass too, so very good morning. I got a really pretty shot here I really like. You got the fog lifting, nice reflection, some light coming in. Really happy with that. Very pretty. May have to move on up the river. But yeah, I also switched to my 17 to 55 lens too. I got enough of the tight shots down here. I think I got a good tight shot over here too along the bank. So, pretty happy with this. This was a really good spot. So, the sun has come up. I found nothing along the river I wanted to shoot. But I still want to keep shooting. So I've switched my camera over to monochrome. And I think I'm just going to ride the country roads. And just if I see something I like, I'm just going to take a quick picture out the window. Sometimes it's fun. I just don't want to go home yet. Jody's still sleeping. I don't want to wake her up. Uh, it's about 9.15. So, you know, there's not a cloud in the sky. So, the light's harsh. You know, I might find something interesting. Shooting monochrome. So, we'll see. See what I get. Might walk around downtown Rogers. Well, I don't know. We'll see as it happens. But... Just in the mood to do a little black and white photography. So, yeah. Let's hit the roads, guys. Well, it's a pretty day here in Rogersville and I think I found my first composition a couple red chairs but I'm shooting black and white but that's what I'm looking at a couple red chairs here on the sidewalk I might even do a shot for my places to set so these red chairs is what I'm looking at shooting downhill so yeah I'm gonna work this scene a minute and see what I come up with so I did a few shots of the post office, 
and I've walked the strip here and I've taken a few shots but I think there's a few more on this side of the road I want to get where the lights hit on the other side of the road so I'm gonna walk down that way all right so I like this old barbershop sign here and the view downtown so I'm gonna work this little scene a little bit the church bells are going off everywhere I might go down that way toward that church too I don't know we'll see but I really like this right here the barbershop so we'll look at this in a minute well guys I think it's gonna do it for me today I'm gonna go home edit these videos edit these pictures and hopefully get some more videos coming out um no idea what's coming up <laughs> we've had so much stuff happen i haven't had time to sit back and just chill and relax and think about what's going on so i don't know i don't know what's next probably some more local stuff coming up maybe some polaroid um would like to get up early and go to bays mountain one day and get it before the fall color's gone so we'll see but uh thanks for liking sharing subscribing all that good stuff guys i appreciate you um hope you like these photos these are all the black and white monochrome shots that i like that i took so yeah pretty good day it's about 10 30 time to head home later guys